Kate is six, uh, Luke is three. Uh, we've got another one uh, coming in July this year. Uh, but we're at Peach Pig in Paradise. Uh, it's our pick your own farm, uh, peaches and nectarines. Uh, and then uh, we've also got cattle and turkeys. You know, with having uh, uh, two kids with you all the time, uh, you know, it, it gives you some perspective sometimes uh, that, that you would lack. Uh, and it's, you know, it's enjoyable, you know, at the end of the day to go uh, pick them up or, uh, you know, if you got to go run and do something that, you know, may, uh, maybe you just need somebody to, you know, give you somebody to talk to or listen listening ear, you know, and, uh, and just kind of see what, uh, you know, what their views of it are. Because, uh, you know, one thing about those two is they'll always ask questions. Look. All right. So see your, they've got their, uh, the shuck, that's the, uh, what they call the shuck there, and that's part of the, the flower, you know, the bloom, the petals would have already fallen where it shuck split. So that's gonna be a peach right there. It's a red haven. You wanna hold it? And then the wind, see, look at that right there. See how the shuck came off? Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> It's a milk carton. And what does it do? It protects the um, peach tree from getting um, bitten by other animals. Okay. And what is your what is your dad taught you? He has taught me how the peach trees have grown and of how the seeds have been making it with without the wind blowing them away. Mm -hmm. And that's about, I think, all I know. Okay. There it's you go. 40 now. It, well, it's, that's, a, it's a, that's our kilovolts. That yeah, tells like us how hot our fence is. How so is. it's about a 4.2. We use this. If, we can use our hand if we want, but it'll pop us. That's why we use this. You want to grab it? Oh, okay. Then we'll just use this then. So anyway, I wish it could be a little bit hotter, but it was down this morning, so it's uh, it's still building some charge. There's the two bulls. They're going to fight a little. Um, those two over there, the biggest ones. And that one's moving a little bit. Yeah. The one near that cat. I mean the um, pepper. My favorite farm record is a chapter. The red chatter. What do they do? They spray stuff. Mm -hmm. What else about tractors can you tell me? Mm, they, they have bucket and brush on them. Cool. Do you know any other kinds of tractors? No. <laughs> <laughs> what about the blue tractor? Yeah, I love blue tractor. Mom, Mom, Dad, why can we go on the blue tractor ride? Woo! Move pastures, we give them mineral in a new spot. And what does that do? It calls the cows over. give them our other two bags here. Ooh. He's feeding the 
cows. What are we feeding them? Mineral. Mineral? Yeah. They need mineral because they can't get all their nutrition from grass. A heifer is kind of like between a baby calf and a grown up cow. Tagging baby calves and how that has happened. Well, um, when they're first born, we get in the gator and we, um, well, if it's too run, if, 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 it, if it can run faster than dad, we just leave it. Um, and if it's like just asleep, because one time we were um, out tagging the cow, and um, the calf was just laying there. And a lot of times, if you listen real closely, instead of just talking, um, you'll hear a little of um, a sheep noise or something. Yeah, that's what baby cows sound like when they're getting tagged. Sometimes if they're um, nervous or if they want to get like away 